Hello Exosolutionist. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, you will learn about multi-threading. This is the sample output. We have a class named my thread class. We have created two static threads. Static thread one method. Inside of it, we have initialized loop condition. For loop start with x is equals to zero with a limit of x is less than equal to two then increment it. Then we initialize the thread variable name as thread is equals to the current thread. We print the name of the thread in the loop of x. Then sleep for five seconds. static thread two methods. Inside of it, we have initialized loop condition. For loop start with y is equals to zero with a limit of y is less than equal to five then increment it. Then we initialize the thread variable name as thread is equals to the current thread. We print the name of the thread in the loop of y. Then sleep to 1.5 seconds. Let's go to our form class. We have initialized four threads, thread A, thread C, thread B, thread D. Then we created a button on click event for button 1. Inside of the event, we set the label 1 text to thread start. We print thread 1 start. We have declared all four threads that are equal to a new thread with the parameter of our created class my thread class and its method thread1 function. Then start all of four threads, and then join them all to start them all at once. We have declared all four threads that are equal to a new thread with the parameter of our created class my thread class and its method thread2 functions. Then start all of four threads, and then join them all to start them all at once. And after the thread end we set the label 1 text to end of thread then we print it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel.